oh, oh. I'm doing this tonight. You're probably gonna start a fight. I know this can be right. Hey, baby, come on. I loved you endlessly when you weren't there for me. No, now it's time to leave and make it alone. I know that I can't take no more. Ain't no lie. I wanna see you out that door, baby. Bye, 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 bye. Wanna be a fool for you? Just another player in your game for two. You may hate me, but it ain't no lie. Bye, 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 bye. Don't really stop. It might sound crazy, but it ain't no lie, baby. Bye, bye, bye. Oh. Hello, everyone. I'm Master Batman, and today I am going to learn what woke is. Because, okay, so. I don't know what that is. I'm Filipino, so I don't know anything about American politics. But, uh, I've been watching like some videos and been hearing the word woke all the time. And, uh, yeah, yeah. Also, my friend keeps talking about the word woke. So, okay, I think it's about racism? I don't know. In reality, I don't know. But let's see what it means. Okay. Okay. This is my first reaction to what woke is. What is woke? Past of wake. That does not mean woke in the context I'm thinking about. What is the meaning of woke culture? Okay. Okay. Oh, what does woke mean and why are some conservatives using it? The definition of woke changes depending on who you ask. Wait, who are... Did a liberal write this? I know what a liberal is. I know what a conservative is. Am I getting to hot water? <laughs> That's some type of sandwich? So if I would, if I were to ask someone, are you woke? And then the person says, hell no, I'm a sandwich. Is, does that comply with what this is? It changes depending on who you ask. Clearly, uh, someone very intelligent wrote this. I still don't know what it means. Let's keep reading. The term has recently been used by some conservatives as an umbrella term for progressive values, often using it with negative connotations. Hmm, interesting. The term was originally coined by progressive black or Americans and used it racial just racial justice movements in the early to mid 1900s. By the way, if you want to see what this is, I'm checking out uh what do you call this? What does woke mean and why are some conservatives using it by Chiara Alfonesca? January 24, 2024. Okay. So. Okay. There's a lot of history crap here. I'm gonna keep reading. Wait. I am so sorry that was my little brother being treat, uh, met with my aunt. Sorry. <laughs> anyway. Uh, to be woke, particularly in black community, means that someone is informed, educated, and conscious of social injustice and racial inequality. So I guess it does mean it's progressive, I think. So, why is woke a bad thing? <laughs> okay, okay, we're getting there, we're getting there. Alright, I, rem I remember this, this was in my political science class. Michael Brown. Fatal shooting, yeah, uh-huh, uh-huh. Ohio University. Mm -hmm. I'm not gonna make an Ohio joke that's inappropriate right now. Has been used for Trump. Car inside corporate America's social justice scam. 
Okay. Uh -huh. We reject woke ideology. We will never s ever surrender to the woke agenda. Okay, now I'm gonna look for a conservative something something. I have no fucking clue what this is. Or maybe I should re keep reading. Uh, my ADHD brain isn't working. Okay. I don't know if I'm ADHD though. I haven't properly diagnosed. As of the moment. But I, I've been told by a psychiatrist relative that I am. I don't know. So that means I am diagnosed. Blood what? So... I don't get it. So anything progressive is bad? Isn't that like... It's like illegalizing an entire ideology. Isn't that your you Americans' whole thing? Like, you have two ideologies. You guys keep fighting. Now this thing is genociding the other thing. Oh, here, Wikipedia page. Woke is an adjective derived from American, Amer African American vernacular language. English, voila. Social inequalities. Woke also has been used short on ideas the American left. I think it's the woke term being you sarcastic as a pejorative. Oh, there you go. Among many political right and most some centrists in Western countries targeting various leftist and progressive movements. Woke washing. Fair. Okay. Oh, I get it now. By being woke, you could become right. Okay. So who's the bad guy? <laughs> Ah, okay. There is no bad guy. Okay, my hair is kind of messy. Um, okay, here's my thoughts on all, all of this. This is a very stupid... I'm kidding. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna be light. Um, why does this matter? Because, <laughs> okay... I got introduced to the word when I first watched a video, a critical video, about Little Mermaid. People were offended that she was black. I mean, I get it, but, I mean, yeah, I get it. First of all, the original Little Mermaid in the novel and in the movie was white. And he, she was essentially blackwashed. And it's meant to... It's a bad thing because marginalized races in the quote unquote uh, racial caste system, as the uh, as I've seen in some messed up historical shit, especially with um, the regime of the East back then. I remember that we were studying that apparently there was a caste system. That uh, Mr. the bad guy, the big bad from the mustache model, the, uh, the art school uh, lesser, the art school quitter received. I don't know if he quit. I... Oh, wait. No, no, no. He he was banished? No, 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 no. I need to regain my thoughts. Whatever. The point is, blood was... Uh, bl evil bl mustache model blood, not me, was... Uh, doing very far right stuff inside of me, caste system, and it created eventually. Ah, 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 okay, 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 okay. So, what is woke washing? Woke washing is when American companies use marginalized races for financial gain advertising them like some sort of like Ooh, look at this we have black people filipino people like you like you and we are gonna oh great isn't it great we are gonna we are gonna ha -ha, we are gonna we're gonna we're gonna put them put them in the movie and you're gonna like it you're gonna like it you're gonna like it well okay I guess that's offensive. I get it, I get it. I get why it's offensive. And I get why people would get mad by it. 
Huh. Okay, I see, I see. Because it's your expression. So in other words, woke is essentially offensive to all, all, right, left, and everyone else. I think? Am I right? Or am I looking into this too much? I don't know. Here are my thoughts on this though. I have nothing. Okay. So in my perspective, I'm a Filipino, right? I'm a Filipino and our politics is messy. And I'm not allowed to talk about it here. So far. Because considering where I come from. And where I live and who I live with. <laughs> but this is by far this woke thing, um it's a huger problem in America, primarily because it's a melting pot of cultures. I think that's a, that's just a theory going on in my head right now. And because of that, it's a melting pot of cultures, especially New York, for example. I mean, I know New York is like a melting pot for all, a lot of cultures, and not, not all. Essentially, you create a toxic environment. Not saying that it's a bad thing to have this melting pot. But you, cr you can create a toxic environment with these two ideologies, you know. I feel like you guys... <laughs> Created something very dangerous. <laughs> Woke capitalism, huh? Interesting. Woke washing. See? Um. Rather. Okay. The idea is. Okay. It's not. Neither race's fault. It's neither any. Winger's fault. Chicken wings. It's the fault of the corporation, to be fair. Corporations, please do better. Uh, if you won't listen to me, well, uh, F you. <laughs> you guys are... And I think... When you think about it, when you think about it, the corporations want this, right? Think about it. The more the, more the corporations sell this product, this product of marginalized race, ooh, in my movies, people are gonna talk about it. People are gonna effing talk about it, and the more people talk about it, the more the more people um walk the talk, and the more people destroy the product, and the more Disney gets money because people watch the product, and the more um the more shit like like corporations like Warner Bros or or Disney Disney Corporation like 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 do shit and and get more money, they get more money, right? And they get more, they then, their idea is that they get more, uh, they blackwash more, they pinoy wash more, they woke wash more, they, they create more of this diversity, but in reality, they're, they're doing this woke washing thing in order to create more chaos, more chaos, more chaos until everyone buys their products, the more destruction and destruction and extinction happens in your country. Is that, am I getting right? So what's the best way to handle this? I believe, um, have, just stop talking about it. Like what I'm doing, stop talking about it. If everyone stops talking, if everyone shuts up, we can win. No fucking way. If we, we, we stop talking, guys. If we as a nation, as one world, stop talking about this. Like what I'm doing right now, which is kind of hypocritical. We could save America. America, whatever. I said, I know it's America, but I, I, I said I'm awake. I'm awake. <laughs> oh, you guys are so cute with your little politics. <laughs> anyway. Mm. 
Yeah, woke. Am I woke for making Jotaro Kujo Filipino in my fanfiction? Well, no, because I'm not advertising that. I just... He's just self-insert. <laughs> uh, it's a self-insert. And I'm proud of it being a self-insert. And I'm trying to make him a good self-insert. I'm trying. I'm trying, guys. Yeah. And instead of, like, advertising uh, the race itself, I advertise the the cancers of the society of the race itself. Uh, in my book, I show all the problems in the Philippine people. And I meant to, like, try to solve them. But in the end, it ends cruelly with... Ah, it'll spoil you. <laughs> but, you know... Will there, will will we have the perfect society in the end? Probably not. <laughs> Bye, guys.